Hello, my name is Jupiter Hadley, and today we're doing another version of GP Plays All the Games, this time with the Ludum Dari 53. The Ludum Dari is a very different type of game jam. It's one of the first I ever covered. It has a competition, which are 48 hours, super strict, a jam, which is 72 hours, more relaxed, and then also a three-week-long extra, which is new this year, I think. The theme is delivery. There are thousands of entries in this game jam, and so I'm not going to be able to play them all. Put that out there now. I will be playing all of the games that were entered into my spreadsheet, linked in the description, between now and the end of the rating period. So there's a countdown on the website, it shows the rating period, I'll be playing them all until the end. My favorites, I'm going to round up into a favorites video, which will highlight just those games. I'll be playing each one for a minute each, links to the individual games in the description, so you can check them out further, and all my info is also in the description. Thank you for watching and liking and commenting. Next. We're playing Adranes, I didn't say their name right. Um, thread delivery, drag and drop, reach drop zones to stop to deliver goods, use WSD arrow keys to navigate, use space for breaks. Be careful, don't break anything. Okay, sounds like a race. Okay, oh, it wasn't, like, moving me forward. But I guess that's because I wasn't pressing forward. <laughs> it just took me a minute. Oh, okay. I'm I'm not good at this at all. Okay. Okay. I mean, they're just bucks, right? They definitely couldn't actually get hurt. See how the like car has smoke coming off of it? Oh, who built this city? goodness. This is really challenging. It feels really tough. I wouldn't enjoy this job and I'm not sure why I didn't just oh, lay all the books across the back like a normal person. Okay, we're, we're fine. Everyone's fine. Books are fine. It's like the last Okay, cool. We're good. We just gotta go straight. The thing is, the car doesn't even ever go straight. <laughs> it kind of goes at an angle. We did it! <laughs> wow, that's a nerve-wracking game, to be honest. This is a glass gnome. Yeah, no. <laughs> Next! We're playing Supernova. Super. Welcome to Supernova that. Delivery. Your mission is to collect and deliver packages all across the galaxy. Together, we will create a convenient and profitable future. Cool. We're about to give you a package to hand off to the planet Baxtrock 2. As you will see in your deliveries list, you'll receive a reward for your efforts. Fly over there and stay close to deliver the package. Got it. I'm there. Right? Oh, it can like picked up. I'm probably in the very middle of this actually. Oh, so we just gotta hang out. Oh no, don't smash into the planet. I thought that I could fly over it. Not gonna lie. Cool. Well done. Now you have a new mission. It looks like it needs you to deliver to Pulsepan Prime, but you don't know where that is. Cool, well. Huh? You're going to have to upgrade your oh, sensor that's fine. range. Right. So there's upgrades. Open the upgrades menu on the left hand side and purchase the sensor range upgrade. Okay, I like the voice acting in this. Sen yeah, sensor range. Great. Cool. Don't forget to pick up the delivery from Backstrock 1 before you. Cool, got it. So we always gotta pick up a package, and then we'll get the package. Wait a minute. That's here. Right? No? Yes, it's that little one. Did we get it? We got it. Okay, and now we gotta go to this prime thing. Cool! And then we get 500 for this. It looked like there were a lot of different upgrades. This feels really polished. 
Dun, 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 dun. We're nearly there. So it should show up on my map, right? Uh, it looks like a very windy version of Earth. I wonder what we're delivering. But I guess I'd always be curious. Cool. Well done. Now Next. Don't let any we're playing Postman Battle. We hit tutorial. Welcome to the Postman Battle, the ultimate showdown where a motley crew of oddballs clash over a single package. Can be the first one to deliver it to the destination. Perfect for zero to four players who face off against each other in a chaotic, fast paced race to claim the title champion postman. Be prepared to face our unpredictable and utterly fabulous AI. So it looks like WASD. It'll be fine. Never am I. <laughs> Do we have a deal? Oh, again? I'm the best choice you'll get. Let me in! Whee! Let's go! I like this one. Oh god, our controls are changing. D. Oh no, it's, it's W. A. S. Oh no! Oh. A. S. Oh. Okay. This is like actually frustrating, <laughs> you know? Oh, wait, it's right by me. S S I can't I can't even I can't even see the letter. Uh, and then oh I have to like steal st I have to battle. A S S S Did I get to keep it? I I didn't. And now I'm gonna completely different it. Okay. Cool. <laughs> I like that there's a battle mechanic. It is unfinished, they said it was. The characters are really fun though. Next. We're playing X E D E F. Cool. Make your box for sir. Get the packages, deliver the packages, go faster, your boss needs more money. Press space to honk, honk, honk. Left and right to throw packages. Okay. Where do I have to deliver them though? A few packages to get delivered. Oh. I'd like to speak to the manager. I'd like I mean, to be honest, same. Oh! It's about time. De decent. Okay. Right. It's about time it is a little rude. I don't like honking my horn, actually. I know I'm trying, but it's very, very floaty. But we're in positive, net positive. I'm gonna go on to just like a little dirt road. It's that way. It's like such relaxing music, but I'm not having a relaxing time. Alright, so it's this. Ah, oh, it's always going the wrong way. It's never going the right way. Yeah. Sorry. I'm actually new to the job. I got a full tank of gas. Okay, cool. We. I think it's down here, though. Ooh, a few packages to deliver. Thanks. I feel like where I was going is gone now. Alright, so we're in there. Okay, cool. No, that, that definitely should have counted. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Next. We're playing Galaxy Express, delivering where no one else dares. You are hired. You work as a delivery operator, a full a job full of adventures. Alright, so we gotta deliver these. I like this movement. I think this is good movement. Feels fun. Boop. That's it. Day over. Get paid if we deliver. You must deliver. Nothing else matters. Okay. What? Should we have armor from the armory? How do we? I guess we gotta explode it. It's like a bomb. Do is go. Alright, we will keep trying. You've destroyed. Oh, alright. It's okay, I didn't know these were bombs. I thought this was armor because it said armory. I was like, oh, it must be armor. But first, I will destroy this area so that I can get in and out with the package. Oh, no. Okay. I didn't grab it properly, but that's okay because we still have one more. I had a. What 
got what got broken. Next, we're playing Fertil Fertility Island. Apparently, the record is seven babies. Space to release the child. <laughs> Where's the correct house? Okay, so a blue house with sort of yellowy. Oh, so we've got to find it. Two floors. A blue house. Two floors. It's this has three. Floors. Yeah, maybe. Oh God. Well, cool. I'm actually not good at anything to do with delivery. Right, let's have a look at two floors. Cool. Red roof. So this this kind of looks like three floors to me. I don't know. Drop baby here. Oh, I wasn't close enough at all. Oh, I was close. Well, yeah, I don't know. That's hard. <laughs> Next. We're playing Rover Herd. Your goal is to deliver a herd of beasts to the village. Here is the Whistler Beast. If you use your whistle near one by pressing one, it'll follow you. <sighs> Our character's really cute. Alright, do you want some beasties? Three beasties, let's go. Ah, oh, they're so cute. Here you go. All beasties delivered. Wonderful. Look out for orange dots that mark their greys. They'll follow you if they spot you. But be careful, they're skittish creatures. They will run if they hear your whistle. Alright, so these are a different type of beastie. They follow the leader. Oh, that's cute. I don't like that they've lessened my pay. back. Yeah, they ran away. Is this one following me? I think it is, actually. Come on. Yay. Alright, last one. These characters are so adorable. They're so tiny. Hmm. Next. We're playing Pizza Rush. have the pizzas? Where are we meant to actually deliver them? We have the pizzas now. <laughs> wow. Imagine living this close to a, a pizza thing. Alright, so we got this one. Alright, one's a bit further, I bet. It does feel really floaty, but maybe that's fun. One. Okay, cool. I can deliver pizzas. I like how they're calling it the pizza house. Seven, six, not enough time. Oh, there's spikes now. Three. Oh, barely. Barely. Okay. Wow. Yeah, that was a big death. Maybe I can't deliver pizzas. Next. We're playing Gobex. I'm gonna do tutorial because they told me to. Welcome to the Garbex, the completely legit goblin postal service. Humans are silly and like to send gifts in the post. Steal the precious loot and insert an appropriate replacement gift. So I guess I give them. Pick up and right click to tear open that. Oh, I thought it was a ball. Okay. It is a ball. And then give it coal. And then what? Insert coal and set. That'll show them. Drag their gift to the spring. That's there. Like this. Got it. We probably still want letters, right? We don't have to take the letters. Oh, the goblin likes the balls. That's adorable. Right. A lot of people are sending balls. There must have been like some sale. Oh, this happiness increase. You can find money in letters. All right. So a ball should be coal, a controller potato. Okay, so they're about the same shape. Cool. Well, we'll just we'll just try it.
How do I get... I need, like, items. Oh. Hey, we can have this. We can have this. Oh, yay, money. Put... We don't have any of the stuff. That's the real issue. You meant to buy it? I feel like I missed something. Something important. Get rid of these because we've already checked them. We'll move everything off the clipboard. So I feel like the oh, is it like one? Yeah. Okay, so you press one. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Just occasionally, though. Put these potatoes in. I'd be so sad if I ended up with potatoes. And that's not what I meant. This, yay. He seems sad. Do you want a ball? Okay. This is really fun. I think this is so cute. And also, oh, that's wrong. <laughs> Next. We're playing Burnout. Use only like three, use only like letters and numbers, minimal three characters maximum. All right, sister name. Dear Jupiter, Burnout contains a playing field of six elements. You can move the arrow, keys, or A and D up. W is to enter rooms, open books at the desk, leave, pick up babies from the incubator, and rogue parents at the waiting room with the space bar to go to the next text. And that's a lot of information. A lot of information. Uh, uh, give the child to the right parents. We're just going to try it. There's just a lot of information. I'm not going to remember it all. All right, baby. Help in, need help in room 105. How do I know what room 105 is? 106. You don't need help in room 106. How do I go back through the door? Oh, we just. Alright, 105. Be quiet and gentle now. She needs to rest. The parents will pick her up after calling their family. Miss Anderson needs to recover from the childbirth. The father will head down to pick up the pink clothing and a like for their child from their Toyota if they can find their car between them all. I wish Harriet would not go see these patients. She does not seem to react comfortably on the parents. The nurse murmurs confidently. Off you go. Alright, assistance in room 106. You, okay, so I have to put back this baby. Alright, this is theirs, so I'll put it there. Okay. Iris is our name. Original, don't you think? Any who your colleagues' eyes make contact with you, holding you up a bit longer. Could you help? The parents have been discussing about the birth card. What theme would you choose? Fantasy. You mentioned a scene of baby playing with magic. That sounds interesting indeed. I'll suggest it to them. Alright. This is the next baby. Okay. The next plain one. Ah, this I'm already going to forget. 103. Okay. The boy's called William, his parents are Mr. I like that there's a story with each one. I'm just definitely never going to get them correct. I like that there are different things on the baby chairs so that you could remember. But I don't know if like certain parents would be like, my baby needs a balloon. So I guess that'd come with time. Next. <laughs>